Ooh. Alright, Duraludon sweeps me. GG. Um, Bear Scoot is also a really interesting Pokemon. I think we can't run Silvalli and Hippo on the same team. That's too much water weakness. Darmanta and Weavile on the same team is probably for a different meta. Like, I feel so disrespected right now. Like, Garchomp meta probably loves that. We just need Ice to be more effective, but there's too much shenanigans going on. And it's the Barrascuta into my Hippo. Great. Have some fun. Let's see where this goes. There's no way that's poison. Ghost. Okay, good. I just hope that KOs. God damn it, dude. This almost feels stream snipey, but I'm not gonna say that because I'm just like, at this point, we're just, we're just getting, we're just getting like the most mirror, like we're just getting a, a wacko mirror, you know, funhouse mirror game at this point. It's where everything I do is just gonna be responded by rule 63 verbalists. This is like the secret boss of the game where you fight your alternative self. Yeah, dude, this is definitely a shadow fight. So it's like, I could not Dynamax Primarina there, but we all know that Silvalli is Dynamaxing and the game's just gonna get awkward. Like, at this point, I've just accepted my fate that I'm destined to lose. What if KO'd too? What if KO'd in the non Nega Verlus world? That Electratorium boost and Max Lightning turns a not KO into a KO. I think it's Weavile time. Yeah, we got the Night Slash on it. Spider-Man meme. This is just the result of someone that has like, <laughs> studied me way too well. Oh, that's dumb. Oh, that was a free swords dance. Huh. But not. Damage is damage. I think I'm gonna take out Silvalli and put in Rillaboom. I think that'll tie the team together. This is the ultimate version of the No You card. Dude, it feels it. What am I supposed to do in this situation? There is no do, there is only lose. Now what I do know is I'm not gonna stay in a losing position. This is hip out on setup time. This has to be hip out on setup time. It's like you can just iron defense my Weavile and then nothing I do matters. Actually, you know what? I shouldn't feel bad about this. No matter what, I win. You know, if you think about it. See? 
I have to think like me. I am now playing against myself. So I have to lose the boss fight like three times to realize it's like mirroring my patterns, but with like a three frame, you know, recoil. <laughs> so I have to just get ahead of myself and I win. I want to cry. My lip actually quivered there. I just how upsetting a, a random crit is for no reason. Legitimately furious. I think, I think I felt like a blood vessel just pop in my brain. If I stop talking, it means I died of an aneurysm from just from just this battle. See, this is how the haters need to do it. Maybe this maybe this isn't like the most dedicated fan ever. Maybe this is just like a really really good hater that realized by becoming me, they can destroy me. Then everyone wins. But what I have learned is I think I haven't won a battle with all creamy yet. So by bringing all creamy, I've baited myself into a loss. Did we, did like, dimensional bubble, like, what the hell is going on, guys? Did dimensional bubbles touch? Did we just flip it up? We Mandela affecting right now? That's fine. We can, we can have a few of those in this. I know it's, like, the same all creamy, but that's why I'm, like, confident I can win now, because this all creamy doesn't do jack. This arena is the space between dimensions. Yes. Just need to posture a hippo until we win the game. No Urshifu means hippo wins. Been following some X and Y. Damn, cool. Thank you very much for the support. I want to slack off, but I feel like I can gain health with all these defenses. Instead of, you know, take too much damage into a body press. Like, we're thick right now. And he doesn't have rain. Yeah, see, that's nothing. Like, what makes that Pokemon scary is when it's rain and maxed and faster than everything. When it doesn't have rain and Dynamax, which was already blown by the Silvalli, it's actually not that scary of a Pokemon. However, this is not Verlus. This is Anti-Nega Reverse Shadow Verlus, because I never use those moves. Like, a Switch move? Person slept on his homework. However, Durulodon is filthy. We need this to KO. I'm not sure. Actually, no, it's not Dynamax Durulodon either. Oh, wow. Okay, so I broke the all creamy, and then, like, we reset the dimension, guys. This isn't Steel Beam. This isn't Solar Beam. This isn't Dynamax. I am actually... I'm fixing the world. The black hole that opened up in this timeline, I have to stitch together by conquering myself. It's just body press until we win. Oh, no miss. That's unfair. Watch me get flinched. Because I do lose to myself. Okay. That was like the only scary part. <laughs> I was facing myself, the Icicle Crash would miss, but like the Nega you gets like the um, impossible buff, you know? 
Like they they they're you but perfect. Ooh, that hyper beam sounds filthy though. I can respect it. I like the I like hyper beam tech on any Pokemon, but Hippowdon's just kind of the best Pokemon ever. Yo, Anthony, what's up? Thanks for joining the stream. We did it, boys! We saved the universe from spatial collapse. Like, what needed to happen was, like, when this battle started, the game needed to register what was going on and just start playing the uh, gym leader theme in reverse. Screw it, just switch all the way over to Lavender Town. There's two spooky wee woo guys. I'm 99% sure that if I say, like, Rule 63 Burless Battle, I will get demonetized. <laughs> I think that has to be, like, a flag term in YouTube. How, how do I title this battle? God damn it, that's freaky! GG, though, that was fun. We had fun. I need to save that card. 69 health? Nice.